What's going on, yo, Mad Dad? Yes, indeed, is back in this mad den. Here to, you know, give some CFB, some rules, some college football 25. We're going to get into this little road to glory deep dive. I'm trying to get these videos up and running again. So thank you all for joining me. And I really appreciate your time taking it out for today. So as I said, they dropped today the deep dive on the road to glory. The road to glory, which is kind of like one of those, you know, classic, you know, you, you pick a player and you write it out, you make it realistic. They try to mimic it as much as the college football experience can be as possible. Um, you know, and they, you know, I think they're going to do a really good job with it as far as EA is concerned. It looks like they put a lot of, you know, energy into this. Um, so let's just dive right into it. So basically what this is, is like one of your, um, what was the one they used to call back in the day, uh, um, I forget the name of the one. God, I'm getting old. I can't remember the names of it. But you basically just, you know, it's you're, you're, you're making decisions based upon your player. You're trying to get them to be a top player, win championships, depending on what your goals are. So how it starts basically is you can be four different types of players. You can be elite. That's like a five-star person expected to come in and make an immediate impact on the team. I believe your overall is like a 79. And, you know, you're ready to just start going and, 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 and make plays. Blue chip is you're a four-star recruit, so you're going to go down a tier on that one. You're a 75 overall, uh, overall, and you get, you know, only one mental, you know, different mental abilities you get, and I think you only get one of them there. The contributor, that's the one right below that. Um, I did, it, didn't have an, it didn't give an overall for that one, but it seems like you will be, um, you know, someone that's trying to you know, work their way up the, the, the tadpole, or the pole, the tadpole, like a frog, I guess. Uh, underdog is the last one. Underdog. And that's when you're just a person that just barely made it on the field. You're a 60 overall, you're a two-star recruit, and you're just trying to get your, you know, get going on there. So that's the first decision you're going to have to make when you jump right in there. And then from there, you get to choose your position. I believe there's four positions. your quarterback, running back, wide receiver, linebacker, or cornerback. And that is five. I said four. I'm in five. Again, the rest is just coming back. Dust off my brain. All this rust will cause stains. Once it gets in the brain, the trust triggers your pain. I don't know why I just said that. But yes, that's what happens when you don't make videos for a minute. I mean, I don't know. Look down there. I don't know. My last video has been like two years. I don't know. We're trying to get right back into this. This college football road to glory. So for based upon that, you get your archetype. You know, they have different types of archetypes you'll get to choose, you know, based upon your position, you know, kind of like in Madden, we have the field generals, you know, pocket passers, things like that. I'm assuming there'll be different ones. Um, I think they have like option king or things like that for the quarterback. And then once you, then after that, you can have, you know, you make your player look like you or somebody else or who you envision to be. And then uh, from there you go, you get your core mental abilities. You have mental abilities that you'll be able to, to pump off of. A fan favorite. Um, you got, this is the one that everyone loves. You gain compersion at home. The road dog lives um, well under pressure. I'm probably going to be a road dog. I, know, I like that underdog, road dog mentality. Probably be the dogs. Or we're going to go the dog way. And then clear-headed. Um, um, again, this is just a different type of archetype. Um, you'll be able to pick. And based upon these journeys, you are just going to continue to go. So you're the recruit. You start your thing. It's going to kind of make it as, as realistic as, as possible. Um, I guess I've talked to a lot of different college players I've talked about. So the, there's four parts to this, I believe. Um, you have the live the life of a college athlete, you a week to week experience, the fast to fun and highly replayable, and the foundation for the future. So the first one is, you know, the weekly management. So you got you got you got to you got to think about college football player. You know, I and me personally, I never played college football. But I used to work for the UT football team. So I got the first-hand look at what these players go through. I mean, waking up at 5 a.m. for their morning workouts, then going to coming back, eating breakfast, going to class. You know, they're hitting team meetings in between classes. And then they're having to hit study halls every night to make sure they're getting homework done. What I did was I made sure they kept their academics in, in order. And so I saw what these guys had to do. Not to mention if they're linemen, they have these regiments of how much weight they got to gain. So I've seen these boys trying to study and put down all kinds of food. I don't know if they're going to go that deep into it. But yeah, there's things about you got to talk about it. You got to have, there's going to be many games in there to help you up your abilities and up your overalls. Um, 
you're gonna be able to work on you got to keep your gpa up i don't know exactly how that's gonna work but you're gonna obviously a lot your free time during the week whether it be social activity studying studying gameplay studying academics and based upon those things training taking care of your body you'll be able to boost your 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 area so academics leadership health training and brand are things that you'll be able to work on obviously the academics speak for yourself gpa is object a, a, a reflection of your performance and um i, I don't think you're gonna get any real tests or quizzes out there but i don't know who knows maybe you will um fan favorite mental abilities weekly coach trust bonuses based upon the things you do in academics keeping your gpa high leadership there's ways to you can work on your leadership and it's 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 basically a, these are mad skills um and this basically shows how the rest of your team will progress how you're able to bump them up leadership obviously is a reflection of yourself but a reflection of those that you inspire so that'll be something that you work on your health, making sure that you're taking care of yourself. Uh, if your your health meter will go up and low, you're gonna have to, uh, how you can play and how you can be able to recover. Um, so training and recovery is gonna be vital in that aspect, which leads us into training. Um, you know, the best athletes obviously dedicate their time off the field between training and taking care of the things they need to take care of. So that's gonna be a different way. Your brand, and that's your, <laughs> that's your social status. That's all the other stuff that goes into being a superstar. Um, so other than that, you can, you know, have other types of things you can go into. You're going to get stuck with dilemmas. Um, you know, no right or wrong answer in these dilemmas. Basically the dilemma is, you know, how you interact with your teammates and what they you know, have requests for you and whatnot. So, um, there's no wrong answers. It just takes you on different journeys, you know, and then they have NIL deals you can do. Um, you get gameplay off field bonuses, things like that. You get obviously coach, you can build your coach trust and you get those points to help you earn other uh, things as well. I mean, this is a very in depth, you know, road to glory. I mean, I, I'm barely tapping the surface. I just read the blog a little while ago. I wanted to get a video out there so I can just kind of get my feet wet again and kind of see what I'm talking about. So, um, I don't know a lot about this college football game as far as what's what to expect. I mean, we, we've all heard people's feedbacks so are going to have the ultimate team they're gonna have the the dynasty where everyone wants to do rebuilds is what they're talking about rebuilds is the the key word i keep hearing about everywhere all over twitter but um you know a lot of people are just gonna go back to the ultimate team and for some people i mean this is just a small bridge between this and madden you know hopefully it's a really fun game and it really engages us in a different way that madden does because we're so programmed to play the those of us to play ultimate team on um, building a team and and, stri and and striving towards building something you know and being rewarded for it so this road to glory i don't look like it's going to have that type except a self fulfilling you know knowing you could take like for me it would be like the road the underdog and we're going to try to take him the underdog road dog and take him all the way to get an nil deal and possibly you know drafted so again you're gonna have game day experiences you're gonna have to you know uh week to week we talked about that a little while ago the plays are going to be called for you depending on you know what position you have you can't change the plays you know until you earn your coach's trust remember that you gotta earn that coach's trust and then you get more and more um opportunities to you know take more control and they also have a transfer, you know, what, what is it called? A transfer portal, you know, or, the, or enter the transfer portal at the end of the year saying, are you happy with what you're going on? Or do you want to roll the dice and see what else is out there for you? So this is something that's going to be really interesting to see um, how it actually plays out um, long shot. That's what I tried to remember earlier. Remember, I was like, oh, is that one game? Long shot. And they had that song and your partner, damn, my kids are screaming in the background. We don't care. It's our road to glory. Madden. Just around the corner, 25, this college football um, is going to be a really interesting, you know, you know, experience. But other than that, guys, that's all I got really to say. I wanted to get a little bit about this um, Road to Glory. Again, it's got such in-depth. They really spent a lot of time on this in the dynasty. I think the ultimate team is just, a, you know, obviously it's, it speaks for itself. We, we know what to do with that. But more videos to come, guys. I wanted to get this out here, see if we can, you know, what, what kind of traction we can gain. I'm going to try to get this ball rolling. But roll to glory. Deep dive. You can, you can, I'm going to, you know, jump online. Check out, follow, if you follow the college football, you can see the, all the notes written down there and read for yourself. I'm just giving you a broad overview. Basically, it's one of those things that you can just, you know, see how it feels to be a college athlete for those that, you know, haven't even experienced nothing like that, you know. But anyway... I appreciate those watching this video. Drop me comments down below. Let me know what 
you know, what area are you going to be doing? You're going to be doing dinosaur. You're going to be doing those real the rebuilds, the keyword, the hot topic. You're going to be just basic ultimate team grinding out, trying to build this ultimate team, or you're going to do a road to glory and see if you can take your underdog and make him a, a standout. I don't know. Let me know down below, guys. I appreciate you. Um, you know, this is going to be a great time to try to get this YouTube stuff going again. Peace.